I think Foundations is teaching them some general skills that they need to transition to middle school. So it does help to have like a home base or someone that you can talk to because I think it's overwhelming for sixth graders to have seven or eight classes compared to having one or two maybe in elementary school. So that helping that transition is also the place that they learned about their iPads, how to use iPads, somewhere that they can go to if they need help with that or their lockers. It's Friday. We've had a full week of school. We're just saying check in how you're feeling this morning. Usually we do a circle every week, so um, today we start with a kind of check-in for uh, how the week's been, how we're feeling today. Uh, nothing I learned during the week, but I'm planning on trying to learn Icelandic. Cycle time helps us reflect on what we did during the week. I cook, I do dishes, I play, I play golf, I play basketball. When people share and they're going through something, like you feel like you're not the only one. Some people don't like sharing their emotions, but some people do, so. And she wants to know how we feel at the moment so she knows how to take care of us. Circle time is to get to know each other and to learn about each other. And you can learn about each other and find what you and somebody else have in common. Team building, collaboration, checking their grades, learning about grades in middle school. Those pieces that work to help students just achieve generally or overall in middle school and, and hopefully that transition to high school and then whatever they choose beyond. Those soft skills that are not necessarily taught creates this bond among the entire sixth grade team that I don't think would actually be there without an uh, entire class period of foundations.